love is so real. I never believe it's strong like this. I never know love can change and transform just like this. One thousand five hundred naira. One five. Yes. Where is it? You mean informer? Yes. Oh, sorry, sir. She doesn't come to work on Saturdays. You are? I'm her boss, sir. Her boss? Yes, sir. That means I should be talking to you. Talking to me. I hope there's no problem, sir. Understand, please. Sir, I used to know to take care of myself I and mean, do my normal chores at home and, you know, sort myself out. So I'll have to get back to you, please. What's that? My yoga and the car wash. What does he want? That I should come to work tomorrow when he knows that tomorrow is my day off. Of course, he knows tomorrow is your day off. Why does he want to stress you? That is what I don't understand. That he wants to discuss something with me. Something that he wouldn't say over the phone or wait till I come to work. I don't think I'm going to go there. Uh, maybe it's something important too. Like writing his will. Will, huh? The man doesn't have a daughter. Clearly, he's seeing you as a daughter figure. Maybe he wants to will everything to you. He's going to about something important. Like what? I think you should start making out with this guy. So you know where the problem is coming from. Okay. I should stop making out with my guy. If I do not satisfy him, then how then do I keep my relationship? So you think it's only love making that satisfies a man? It's very there important. Are, now. It's important, but there are other ways to satisfy a man. You need to try someone else so you know the fault is not from you. I don't think it works in Africa. Oh, really? You go and tell him that. Hello? Yeah, who am I speaking with? And how did you get my number? Who gave you my number? Listen, don't ever call this line again. Mm. Calm down. Who was that? Do you know the so-called bread guy? I don't even know how, how, how he got my number. Why are you, why are you being so hostile? No, this explains why he's been giving you money. You gave him my number, right? If you why, why don't you just want to give this guy a chance? Why just, why is your head just... And then they stop. Stop, stop already. What? Stop, stop. It's my life. It's my relationship. It has everything to do with me. And, and I want you. the best for you. You don't, you don't need to tell me what, what is going to be the best for me. Stop oh, it. really? I'm your friend. I know what is good for I've you. I've told you. I know what's so, good Don't be sharing my number like ah, that. I beg, go. Don't put your ass in one basket. You think it's everybody that have opportunity to meet men that are growing over them like this. I never believe love is so real. I never believe it's strong like this. I never know love can change and transform just like this. Love will get more in I am. She's so exceptional. 
Young man that is seeking your hand in marriage. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Why is he giving you money to give to me? Is he giving you as my father or my father's representative? Not even really if you just try to understand. Uh, this young man wants you to become his wife. My dear, from the look of things, this young man is very serious and harmless. Oga, you said he gave you this money to give to me. Exactly. If you see, you may not know it. I already see you as a friend, a sister, and a daughter. I will not mislead you. And I will not recommend an irresponsible man to marry you, matter the amount he offers to me. See, I have made these mistakes in the time past. And that is why I am still unmarried to today. I don't want you to make similar mistake. Please, my dear, I want you to give this young man a chance. Yes. Olga, okay. I thank you for your concern. You know, at least you are telling me. It's not like it's a forceful thing. No, not at all. Thank you so much, sir. But I have a man in my life. In fact, the relationship is so strong that we are heading towards marriage. And very soon. I told this Greg man, I told him, that I cannot do this. I'm already engaged. But he wouldn't listen. He keeps going to everyone around me begging. He won't work like that. Please, I appreciate your concern and love. I cannot accept this. Tell him that I am taken. I can't have anything whatsoever to do with him. Eh? So please, can I go back to my work? Well, you can go back. But you never told me of any man. Eh, but I'm telling you now. I never believe love is so real. I never believe it's strong like this. I never know love can change and transform just like this. Love will get more. All this disturbance, trying to say, have time with you, is waste of time. I am telling you, I don't know what is wrong with my girl. She practically sleeps off each time we are making love. Just one round, and she's already asleep. Uh, I never see this kind of thing before. I be they wine me. You mean she does that all the time? Like I'm telling you, like all the time. You see, this is the reason I don't like spending time with her. And I really wish you could understand. She needs to get rid of sex from her mindset since it's not working. This is strange, Mark, my guy. 
What relationship trees without sex? You know what to blame her mom. You shouldn't blame her. Because her problem, that is her problem, is Ellen. Well, as for me, I'm engaged with work and I don't really have time for her. But I want the little time I spend with her to count and not just to constantly doze off on me. If you are really sorry, I know I should have sought your consent before giving me your number. Eh? I'm sorry, forgive me. Forgive me. But don't do it again. Listen, this is my decision. It is what I want. Just respect it, okay? No answer. I don't even know that he came here to bribe my uncle as well. Uh -uh. Is it that stinkingly rich that he dashes money to everybody you see? <laughs> my sister, I don't even care. Whether he has more than one than Mark or anything. I love my man. I mean, you know money doesn't entice me, so... Mm -hmm. I don't give it then. I, I just don't know what he sees in you. That made him refuse to give me a chance. Maybe the complexion. Eh? You're fine <laughs> <that. laughs> Okay, you know what? Don't worry yourself. Maybe one day you'll just look your way. Mm. But before then, I am finished. I want to buy this and continue. In front of this place, that woman's shop. Mm -hmm. I've checked there before coming here. Man. I was hungry when I was coming. That's why I bought this thing. Are you serious? Mm. She did come out today. I never believe. <laughs> I never know love can change and transform just like this. Love will get more in the air. It's so deception. Even like that, I don't want them to go and check for you. Imagine me falling in love. No. I'm looking for one Miss Informer. I hope there's no problem. No, there's no problem. Okay, I'm informer. Um, I'll have a password for me. If I want this one, Greg. In the beginning. Greg. I'm not interested. It's not she give you this food. I said I'm not at home. Tell him that I said I don't want it. Take it back. No, you can't, I can't take it back. It's for you. What do you mean? You can take it back. You may have a peg. No, we don't want. Take it back to the person. Ah! I can't take it back. Hey, grab my money. Grab my money. No problem. Sign. Yeah. I should sign over what I didn't take. Should I get one of them? No, what they let me sign. I don't know such thing. You want to eat food? You don't even know how it was made. Let the love potion kill me. You should be ashamed of yourself. Eat a little bit. If you were here talking about this and planting. The woman did not come out. They brought out food for us. They are the ones who get it. That costs one year in our car. So, how are you now going to do it? Hey! Because me, myself, I'll start from here. Hey, thank God I came to your room. Philip, honestly, if I didn't know this girl, I would have said she's pretending. But there is no pretense in all of this. The girl doesn't just like me. She rejects me and I don't know why. Greg, um, it's a very, very uh, dicey situation here. However, um, I think it's something you have to calm down and be more realistic. Just get out of your grandiosity and you will find a very good uh, result. That's all I can say at the moment. Philip, you talk as if you don't know the man seated here. It's SD. I have everything. I have the swag. I have the looks. I have the money. I have everything it takes to win kind of girl. Why is this one different? I've given her everything, my time. Offered her everything. But yet, she still doesn't love me. Don't you think you're being too confident? 
And I think that's really not allowing you to be kind of, um, you know, getting the right facts and your expectations are too high because of the way you've actually, you know, been working out things with other girls. It's not always like that. Sometimes the real things are very difficult to find. So I think you should just push more. I would have said from every indication that she doesn't have interest in you, but the case could be different, so I wouldn't want to, as a friend, discourage you. However, you just have to be more realistic, Greg. I've given her everything. I have a question for you, Greg. You've been saying all this and all that, but you haven't mentioned, have you given her money before? Because, you know, women are very rapacious, so that's the best way to actually find a true definition of your success or failure, so. Oh, Philip. I've offered her money countless times. Gift. I don't even know what she wants. She doesn't seem to accept any material thing from me. But she should know me as the what I want. I'll get. I mean, I have all the looks. I have all the attributes, all the finesse, the money. I have everything it takes to get any girl of my dream. So why would this one be different? Wow, well, this is really different. Indeed, different. I must accept um, it's a very hard note to crack, but if really you're really keen, then you have to go after her. Just you don't have to give up. That's my own advice as a brother. Because I'm really surprised. This is she's very lucky to have you. I've never really seen you, you know, expressing your emotions this way. So I think it's gonna work. Philip. Yeah. No woman has ever stressed me like this, Philip. There's something about this girl. Bro, I promise you one thing, bro. Whatever it takes. I'll do anything. Everything to get that girl. I mean it. You say, Philip. I already told my big sis about her and you know, she's working so hard. It's not been easy. I mean, I've never met a woman who swept me off my feet. Wow. You're really serious with me. Of course I am serious. You need to see the girl. She is everything about me. Alexis. Oh, hey, sis. Huh. Greg. Hmm? I'm sorry we do not have baby soup right now. Well, I sent my girl to go get some things from the market. Wait, Big I'm sis! You really think this is about the pursuit? Please. It's about that girl. She is everything to me right now. I'm oh, sorry I didn't ask you about her. Any luck? Well, not yet, but that girl is kind of stubborn. And as stubborn as is sexy. It's not going to be easy, but you know, I'll keep working, keep pushing. And one day she would look at me eyeball to eyeball and say, I do, I do, I do. <laughs> then why not let her go? Exactly, exactly. This is the exact thing I have said to Greg. But guess what? His reactions are very negative. And this is what will be happening. But that is how it's going to always be. Huh? But come on, please. What are you both talking about? Let her be? That is not in my dictionary at all. I can't let her be. That girl and I have stuck a fuse forever. You guys don't understand how I feel about that girl. I sleep. I see her in my dreams. I wake. I see her. I eat. I mean, she's part of my life. You don't understand. No woman has made me feel this way. I'm not stopping. I'm not letting her go. Who would believe that Greg of all people would finally fall deeply in love with a woman? Behold the woman of my dreams. In whom I am well pleased. Why didn't you tell me my nephew Greg was asking for your hand in marriage? Your nephew? Oh, you people are related? Yes, he's my nephew. I had no idea, ma. I'm really sorry about that. And I'm really sorry... 
on how I spoke to him. I've really been rude to him because he refused to listen to me. I told him I'm in a relationship and I'm not interested in his proposal. I'm sorry about that. When you guys are related. You haven't been yourself ever since you got here. What's happening? It's nothing really much, my darling. I'm just... It's nothing. Nothing? Yes. Just tired from the strenuous work I did at the car wash today. Oh. You know, you should really consider quitting that job. It's too stressful. The bad job is less stressful and better. Baby, both are stressful. Then you should consider leaving them both. You know I can comfortably take care of you. Then I'll stop working. No, baby, no, I'm not like that. I love to be independent. My baby doesn't have to work. I have to work. You can't even take that from me. Okay. <sighs> okay, babe, that reminds me. Hmm? Where is this relationship headed? Because the last time I checked, it's been six years now. I know where you're going with that. And I promise you, very soon I will do the needs for you. Yeah, I know it sounds like me repeating myself over and over again. But this time around, I'm serious. Okay? Baby, I'm just, you know, it's just a reminder. You need to know. Because we get older every day. I'm not getting any younger. I know, I know. I am sorry for the delay. It's just that I have a lot on my plate this time around. I promise you very soon. You come to think of it, baby. Why don't you go out a little bit? You know it's been a long time we did that. I'm here. It's just you go in there, change your clothes and you have me. Good. Now cheer up. I don't want to see you in this face again. Do the needful like you said. I will. Give me a minute. I never believe love is so real. I never believe it's strong like this. I never know love can change and transform just like this. Love will get more. Try to ask me to calm down. You needed to see the guy she was strolling with openly. I mean, what's that? You need to have seen the goggle he was wearing. Old school. Please, that's a slap on my face. Let's not just go there, please. The girl is mine. It'll only take me a little time and I'll show her why I'm called the SD. And what's the meaning of that, SD? You don't want to know. Then you are not ready to settle down. Who says? What do you mean by that big sis? Are you... Are you seeing that girl as a competition? Really? <laughs> oh, please sis, don't insult me. I can buy that guy. Buy him. And in fact, his entire generation. How can you compare me with that guy? Oh, please big sis. The girl in question is mine. Just, you know, a few steps, a few tricks, a few tactics. And she belongs to me. Uh, but, but the Ife I know once told me she's in a relationship. Relationship? With a man? You call that a man? You think a... Big sis? Come on, please don't insult me. You're saying that I'm in competition with that... That thing? So if men are asked to come out, old school goggle nerd will come out. 
please, uh, please, <laughs> please. I know when I'm being insulted. Uh, I'm even surprised that the girl you are referring to is my girl. Ah. That is where you work. Would you, the work would be a lot easier. Baby, what is it? Nothing. What do you mean nothing? I mean, you can't just get up in the heat of it. Come on. Baby, I just don't want to fall asleep again. So you believe making love to me makes you fall asleep? No, babe. It's, it's been a problem to me. I don't even know what is wrong with me. I just can't explain it. Listen, I don't want so no hard things. But I believe we can conquer it together. How? Babe, this is really embarrassing. I mean, it keeps happening all the time. How do I sort this thing out? Okay, okay. I won't stop worrying about it. It's okay. It's okay. Look, I might have complained in the past, but I'm gradually learning to deal with it. Baby, you're so sweet. I want to thank you for everything. Thank you for your love, care and tolerance. I really appreciate it. I mean, I couldn't have asked for a better man. You are the best. Oh. That's my girl. <laughs> you know I miss. I never believe love was so real. I never believe it's strong like this. I never know. <laughs> Mark! Adane, how are Mark, you? Mark, I'm fine. It's been a long time. What are you I doing see. in this area? I'm going to meet a lady to collect a fabric. Oh, I see. And how are you now? I'm very fine, as you can see. When I was leaving the house, my friend told me that she was coming to your house. What happened? Oh, yes, she's at home. I'm actually rushing to pick up the flash drive for a new project. Hey, Mark, you're always busy. Eh? What to do now, my dear? Work will always come. It's not at the detriment of your relationship. And you're not giving my friend time. You just keep distancing yourself from her. And she's hurting, it's not nice. Uh, actually, I have not really been proud of my attitude. But I'm going to make it up to you. You should. Otherwise, you risk losing her together. She's my girl and she will remain my girl. Then you have to make up for her now. Because you know I'm the one close to her. I know how she feels. It's just like me that is single. Eh? But you make it seem like we are both single. Eh? She has a boyfriend that doesn't have time for her, so you see, you are checking time. You can't Actually, even stand I'm, uh, I'm on my way to get something. Then, when coming back, I'll stop by and get food. Oh, that's fine. Just make sure you take care of her. Have her time. That's all she's asked for. She's my girl, and she will always be my girl. I'm not losing her to anybody. Make her feel like one. <laughs> all right, then. I will see you later. Take care. Okay, you all right, bye. I love you. I never believe love is so real I never believe it's strong like this I never know love can change and transform just like this Gray! Gray! What are you still doing love here? It's getting late! Come and start going! I don't think so. I already told you she doesn't work at night. Just go home, go home and relax. I will talk to her. Where I'm going? Go home to work. Huh? I thought it would even become worse because from home I. What is this? What is this? Why has this girl become a man? What is this? This is serious.
just take it easy, okay? Just go with me. Take it she'll be okay. Then, can you send your rider to get it for me? Uh, I want to. I want to contact at home, so I'll forward you the address. All right. All right. Thank you. I'm not surprised he disappointed you. He left you alone, right? Because I saw him on my way back home. You saw Mark? Of course I did. I saw him. Do you know I? I woke up and discovered that Mark left. And I called him so many times, he refused taking my calls. But you told me he went to get something and tell groceries. And I thought he rushed back home to be with you. He never came back. Mark never came back until I left. <laughs> now I'm beginning to think that he's cheating on me. Oh, come on, if you. That's a strong word. And I'll have to find out. That's a strong statement. Greg, you've been silent since I came in. Are you okay? What kind of stupid question is that? Do I look okay? Greg, you've been silent ever since I... I'm supposed to be shouting. I see if we didn't discuss something. Or you don't know why I'm like this. Oh, that's... How much is the contract and um, what's your profit? See if she's going to do anything about it. How much is the contract? How much is it? Just let me be. Let me think on how I'm going to solve this problem myself. Greg, how much is it? Are you trying to mock me now? What do you mean, how much is it? Haven't we discussed about it? Didn't I tell you 10 million? 10 million? Huh? <laughs> You're asking me? Relax. My baby should not be sad. I can do anything for you. Relax. <sighs> <laughs> I want you to myself. I want you to be my forever. I hope this is enough. See, I'm not looking for half of the money. I'm not looking for half of the money. When I'm talking... <laughs> that is the look! Uh-huh. Yes. I don't want my baby to be sad. Yeah, baby. It is for you. For you. I never believe love is so real. I'm ready to watch the camera. You can come out. Everything about you is sweet, even the way you talk about mine. I'm ready to watch the car now. Okay, what is the meaning of this? You have to listen to I me. do not have time for this. Leave me alone. Can you just calm down? Leave me alone! Can't you just calm down? Calm for what? Leave me alone, let me do my job. Leave me! Babe. Who's your babe? See this man. See, you want, you want to see madness? Please. You want to see madness? Please, 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 please. I never believe. Please, please, please. 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 Can I take my car? Get your car! Get out! Okay! Get your car! Okay! Okay! Get your car! Get out of this place! I don't feel I'm sorry! Okay! Okay! Imagine me falling in love Now get out! Now get out! Okay! What a promise is this? With the water, I still love you. I love you. Oh, Should I come so you can boy again? I still love you. Get out. Get out. Get me 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 out. Get
So I decided to rest more. Are you not supposed to be cleaning? Uh, yes, ma'am. My friend, get busy! Sorry, ma'am. Confusion. My sister, that is why I came. Please try and talk to her. I have cautioned my daughter. Pico. Thank you so much for this useful information. I am grateful. Olamma, come here. Okay, fun. Neku mom, have you heard about our Igwe's uh, latest directives? No, mama. That is what this my good friend came to tell me. She said the Igwe has instructed if anyone is caught making love in the bush or doing all this memory woman, all these funny things you put in the bush. He said the person with balabelled a criminal and punished accordingly. Don't be a victim. Huh. Oh mama, mama, how does it concern me? Eh? In a judge. Of course it concerns you. It does concern you and you know it. How? You know what I'm talking about? Uh -uh. You don't know. Olamma, in your interest and for your own good, be careful of the people you mingle with out there. Be careful. Because if you are caught in the act, you are going to face the grace rot and punishment. <laughs> Tell all those boys, if those boys get, get, that chose to be meeting you in the bush, instead of them to come here honorably and ask for your hand in marriage, they chose to go in the bush, name a corner, name a hide and seek. Mama, I know why you are saying all these things, but I will shock you. I am not ready to get married anytime soon. Mama, what is this? Why are you disturbing me? He's getting married by force. Is it my first mama? But you chose to do it secret, secret. Okay, for me. I'm not going to be on for. I don't know what is all this. Hello? Yeah, sister, I am not happy at all. I am not happy. Can you imagine? Mama is forcing me to get married. Sister, I am not happy. I'm going to run away from this house. So if she continues, I will, I will run away from this house. I'm, I'm listening. Sister, I don't want to get married before you. I am not ready for marriage now. You know that. I'm sorry, Ma. But uh, I, I have to go now, Ma. Go? Yes, Ma. What time is it? It's 3 p.m., Ma. It's not even up to 6 o'clock. And you want to go? You know 8 o'clock is our closing time. Yes, I know, ma'am. But I have a very important fellowship to attend. It's very important, ma'am. Please, it won't happen again just today. Please, ma'am. You see, I won't tolerate this next time. Are you hearing me? Yes, ma'am. And before you leave, make sure you clean these chairs. Don't worry, ma'am. I was okay to do the cleaning for her. Ah, thank you. Thank you, ma'am. I'll, I'll just change.
Linda, call. Ify, you've been mute for a while. Why don't you love my nephew? I'm really sorry, Ma, but I know how it feels to expect your worker to accept your request. But Ma, you really need to understand me too. This is the matters of the heart. And there is absolutely nothing I can do about it. I do not love Greg. But you can actually learn how to love him if you give him a chance. I know, Ma, but I... Don't respond now. Just critically think about it, okay? Hmm? It's be nice we have you in our family. Yeah. As you can see, the band wings and the plugins are already installed. You Just may like... not understand what you have. Oh. Until you Hey baby. So Mark, this is it, right? So this is it! So this is the reason you hardly spend time with me. You was rushing off, you want to be in your office. She is the reason. She has been the distraction. She is the career you've been pursuing, right? I beg your pardon. What are you talking about? What am I not talking about? She's my client for Christ's sake. What stupid client are you? Are you telling me? What stupid client? What has gotten into you? Nothing has gotten into me. You have gotten into me. Oh my goodness. I have been such a fool to have believed that you are genuine. Madam, I am very sorry for that. I didn't see it coming, please. Oh, it's okay. Oh, I understand, honestly, I do. Oh, I have to do something before. It, it's colored to so something else and gets irreparable. Thank you very much for your understanding. So, back to what I was showing you. As you can see, I've already installed 12 plugins for the animation you want. I just need to um, lighten up this a bit. Oh, um, what I need to do is to work on the logo and uh, make some corrections on the hyperlink. Okay, th this logo right here? Yeah, okay. exactly. Okay. I'm on it already. Alright. Thank you. Okay. If you ask me, you embarrassed yourself instead. How? What if the lady you saw him with is not who you think she is? It is quite obvious that you haven't been listening to me. No, I have. No, you haven't. Because if you did listen to me, you won't be saying all of this. I said I saw my man with that lady in a compromising position. Mm -hmm. I mean, what would you have me think? I still think you owe him an apology. For what exactly? Please stop this thing you're saying. You're getting me annoyed. What do you mean? Oh my goodness. If you, I think you owe him an apology, how can you just conclude? You just saw the, beside him. Were they kissing? Did you see them hugging each other? You still owe him an apology. Oh, please. Don't even say that. I will never apologize to Mark for anything. I am wise now. I am not a dummy. Listen, Adani, I am very much awake now. And mm. I can never allow any man fool me again. I mean, for what? For what exactly? My mother revealed something to me when she was talking to me about Greg. And I think you need to help me find out the truth about it. You may not understand what you have Until you lose it You may not understand what you have Until you lose it Life treats you just how you treat yourself Life is not what you think Just be wise Life treats you just how you treat yourself What do you think you are doing? No, 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 what do you think you are doing? Just one favor, marry Greg, you said no See, let me tell you I don't want to work with you again as I speak now, leave my car wash. Mother, please, I don't understand. Like, you don't want me 
to be walking here again. Yes! Why? Are you asking me? Just one favor. Marry Greg, you said no. Oh God, I'm really, really disappointed. I'm sorry to say this. I am disappointed in you. Huh? Yes! I thought you said I'm like a daughter to you. Was that not what you told me? So why would you force me? Why would you even advise me to get married to a man I don't love? Because of your selfish interest? Anyway, news flash. Before now, I already decided that I was quitting this job. Yes, I was going to tell you that, but it is good that you told me yourself. I am leaving with all happiness. I am done. I have your balance here. I don't need your money. I don't need your money. Let me go and change my clothes. Come and take your balance. I don't need your money. Can you imagine? You may not understand what you have until you lose it. You may not understand what you have. Until you lose it Life treats you just how you treat yourself Life is not what you think, just be wise Life treats you just how you treat yourself We thank business, we're doing it Where is it you? Who's that? Uma, where is Ify? Sir, Ify is no longer working with me here. I've sacked her. Say that again. I said, sir, Ify is no longer working with me here. I have sacked her. You have sacked her? Yes, sir. Ify is no longer working here, sir. I have sacked her. Yes, sir. Why? Sir, you will not understand. Make me understand. It hurt my pride, sir, that she could disobey me like that. Uh, I told her to give you a chance or leave, but she chose to leave. She hurt your pride. Ogandeka was, she now have pride. You sacked her. Are you aware that I'm the owner of this land that you occupy? So you are just telling me. Now you know. Which means I can just ask you to take this few yards of bows and this old school machine and get out of my land. You sucked her. You don't have pride. I give you three days. You hear me? Three days and then you get her back working here. Huh? Huh? Did you hear me? Sir. Ah! Three days. I wonder if you're going to I never believe love is so real. I never believe he's strong like this. I never. Amos, uh -uh. you're bringing a wizard to the house. <laughs> I'm marrying you. Mama, not that type of wizard. What I'm trying to say is that he's, he's a tech guy. He's very brilliant. He's, he's, okay, he's an expert in computer. He's been doing it for years. He's so good and, you know, don't worry, you'll get to meet him. And you will love him, honestly. <laughs> Although he's very busy, but it's fine. He's busy. And he won't be the Now that he's very busy, how will he be able to take care of you? <laughs> Fine wife like you. Mama boss of mama. Oh no, God, they say busy. No, mama, he, he will take care of me. He has always been doing that. I mean, are you not the one confirming how beautiful I am? Hey, mama. But he has made me look beautiful.